I have got something special to unbox today. I thought I would let you guys join me in this and we do a little review on the product as well as the unboxing. So let's get into it. This is the parcel I received this morning. It was lying outside my door when I got out of the shower and I know exactly what it is. So let's open it so you guys can see. Guys, this is the C922 Pro HD Stream Webcam. For those of you who don't know what it is, basically this is a webcam just like any other. However, it would obviously be able to do a lot better of a live stream when you are streaming live. The reason for this is I don't have a webcam. In South Africa, I did have a, a webcam, but it's not a great one. It, I mean, it was really bad. It looked pixelated and grainy and it was terrible. This one is full HD, 1080 at 30 frames per second, which you can see over there. It also has a hyperfast frame rate in HD. And advanced capture software. I have not used this thing. But we're going to have to have a look and see how this goes. It comes with the webcam, which looks like that. And it's got a tripod as well. I think what's not, what would be nice for me to take this out of the box, quickly put it up for you guys so you can see what it looks like up. And then we can take this review further. What it looks like. Okay, it's actually, it looks so nice and classy and, you know, well made. It doesn't look plasticky or gimmicky. I mean, if you guys have to see some of the stuff that I'm using that I've purchased through Amazon, not, not saying that it's Amazon, um, but the companies that I've purchased it from, they are a little bit on the dodgy side, but then if you're buying cheap, that's going to happen. Well guys, I'm back. I have set it up. It was very easy to do and um, I want to show you guys what it looks like. So let's get to that. I have set it up on my screen just so you can see what it looks like. Let me spin you guys around so you can have a look. Okay, so currently the webcam is on my screen so you can see me moving slightly in the background. Um, but I want you to have a look at the camera itself. So this is the webcam over here. It's got two little lights on the side here. These, this is a speaker on this side and there is a speaker on that side. Now we're a little bit closer. You can see there is your camera. I haven't taken the plastic cover off yet. I'm very, very funny when it comes to that. I like to leave the covers on, but um, that's what it looks like. I'm going to take it off for you guys so you can actually see all the way around what it looks like. This is the webcam. I think you can see it a little bit better like this rather than on my screen. This here is to hold it on your screen so when it's on it's got something to grip on and this will hold the back. It has rubbering over here and it's got some rubber over here just to protect things when it's on your screen you don't want it to scratch it. At the bottom it's got a little screw there's also rubberizing here. With this screw you're going to put your tripod in. This is what the tripod looks like. I'm holding it in my hand because I want you to see how small this is. It's got the little piece at the top that can move around with the ball joint over there. And when you want it in place, you've got this piece over here, which will tighten it. I'm going to leave it right up for now and just tighten it so it doesn't move around while we are busy talking. Okay, so now it's tight. These little legs open up like that. And you can extend them a little bit further. Not much further, but it is a bit further. Like that. I think it's quite a cute little thing. So next to my head you can see exactly how big it is. It's not huge, but it's nice. Especially if you want to just pop it up next to you and maybe you want people to watch you from the side. I think that's quite awesome. Moving on, um, you would obviously connect your webcam with that little screw over there. So it will screw on to there and you can stand it wherever you like. I think it's really cute. I, I love that. The video quality of this webcam seems to be quite good. Apparently the, the one before this is just as good as this one. The difference between the two, when I say the other one, it was the C920. This is the C922. The difference between the two is not much. This one, apparently, you can remove your screen background. So you don't need the green screen here behind you anymore in order to, to frame out your 
your body to see yourself on a screen while you've got something else in the background. That is a nice feature. However, I did watch two YouTubers who were talking about this and both of them say the quality is not the best. However, if you're not worried about that, it would be fine. So if you've got a hair that stands up, especially I think for the guys who have your hair that stands, you can still see distortion when you move your head at the top here. It does still show a little bit of the background in there. But guys, I'm not going to use it for that purpose. So I'm quite happy with this. This is more for FaceTime with my daughter in South Africa or my mother, um, my sister, or even just for me to use maybe if I'm sitting at my desk here to, to do a YouTube video. I don't know if it's really a YouTube-y um, gadget, so I don't know how that's going to work. We can try a video. Maybe I'll do a little recording as well and fit it in here so you guys can see the quality of video. Well, guys, this is me on my webcam, and this is what picture you see which is identical to what I just did on my Galaxy Note 9. So you can see the picture difference. Um, I don't know if there is a difference right now. When I do my editing, I'll obviously be able to see. But I thought I would add a little video clip in just so you guys can see how this video looks. Obviously, there is a bigger background around me, whereas my mobile does not give me this whole big background. So that is really nice. The, the view is very clear. Um, I feel it's more brighter than on my phone. I'm not sure if that's the case. Like I said, I'm not, I haven't got them both next to me, so it's difficult to see. When I'm in editing mode, I will see. If you guys are looking to purchase one, I'll put a link in the bottom for you guys, so you can go and find the special that I got. Hopefully it's still on special, but I'm going to put the link below for you guys in case you decide to purchase one. I will also link the C920, just in case you have maybe viewed the other um, other guys and decided that it is a cheaper option. I hope that I have managed to help you in this purchase in some way as to either steer you towards it or to steer you away from it. It does come with um, a little bit of a how-to. So this is your C922 Pro Stream webcam. It is made by Logitech. From what I understand they're not a bad company when it comes to this kind of thing. There's also this three-month premium split license which is for live streaming. I'm not sure if I will do this, maybe at a later stage I will. If not, I'll probably give it to somebody who would be able to use it. So let's see how that goes. And then also just your instruction manual, some important things you need to know that also comes with. This was purchased on Amazon. It was $99.20, was currently on special. I did feel though, after watching others, um, that maybe I could have got the one down from this. The, the thing is, at the time, we didn't see the other reviews. Now, if I don't need the background to be removed, which is the case, we could have got it a lot cheaper. I'm very happy with my webcam. I hope that you guys um, got something out of this. If you are looking at purchasing one, maybe have a look at the guys I've linked below's videos first. They are a lot more technical when it comes to this, and they may be able to give you a bit more input before you purchase. I'm not knocking it in any way. I just feel... In today's society, especially with what's going on now, money is very limited in certain homes and you may want to rather choose a cheaper option than to go for this um, more expensive option. At the back of the box at the bottom here, it's got all the different functions of three different webcams. The resolution on the two seem to be identical on the C920 and the C92. The video quality, they've both got threes. The focus, both of them have autofocus. I have seen on one of the, the guys that I've linked below, he suggested not to use autofocus. They are both full HD. Field of view is the same on both. And your microphone is stereo on both. This one comes with a tripod. The other one doesn't seem to. And this one has the X split license, which the other one doesn't. And then, of course, also the screen removal at the back, which it doesn't seem to mention anywhere. When we set it up, we tried to use the actual Logitech Capture um, videoing, and I must admit, it didn't work as well for me as my OBS. So I've linked it up through my OBS to rather use there, as I felt that it was a lot better for me. It was very easy. It was quite a bit of um, plug and play. 
So I literally plugged it in, left it for a few seconds, and it automatically did what it had to. The downloading software that you have to, that it suggests you install is actually the software for this camera. If you have others, I'm sure you could use that rather than the Logitech one. But guys, that is my webcam. Very happy with it. I think it looks very cute. It's not too big and bulky. Nice design. If you can use these mics, that would be great for you guys. Like I said to you, I'm going to still figure out how to do that without having all my mattresses in my rooms pulled off and put around me with pillows, as my husband would suggest I do right now. But um, yeah, I'm very happy with it. Well guys, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye guys!